this video we will learn about the origin, conservation, handling, consumption, and all the benefits of leek. I ask that the noble friend or friend subscribe to the channel, leave your like and activate the bell to receive more instructive and high value videos to expand your knowledge, comment here below and give your opinion, share this video with your friends and family and let's go to the video. Leek has been consumed for thousands of years, being known to the ancient Greeks and Romans. It is currently cultivated practically all over the world. In Brazil, its production is concentrated in the southern and southeastern states. It is a seasoning vegetable of the Eliasi family, the same as onions, garlic and chives, being probably native to the Mediterranean region. Its flavor is milder compared to onion. It stands out among vegetables as a source of copper, but it also contributes with other mineral salts and small amounts of vitamins A and C and B3, niacin. Generally, leeks are sold with part of the leaves cut off. The remaining portion of the leaves is dark green, flat and broad. The leaves overlapping each other at the base of the plant form a well-developed, cylindrical, glossy white stalk. When harvested at the ideal point, the stalk is between 10 cm and 20 cm long and between 3 cm and 6 cm in diameter, depending on the variety. Smaller stalks can also be eaten, as long as they have been harvested to this size and are not the remnants of old stalks that have been peeled to remove rotten leaves. Choose firm stems, with green, turgid leaves, without soft, dark areas. When purchasing and transporting at home, handle the product with care to avoid injuries that cause stalk browning. Leeks can be kept in the fridge in a plastic bag for up to 5 days. Preferably, do not wash it before storing it. To freeze, remove the green leaves, roots and the green part of the stalk. Cut the white part in half lengthwise and separate the pieces. Wash well under running water, removing all dirt adhered to the stalk. Place in boiling water for 2 to 3 minutes and then in ice water for 2 to 3 minutes. Drain the water and place the pieces in an open bowl. Place them in the freezer and wait for them to harden. Transfer the frozen pieces to a plastic bag or covered container. In this condition, it can be kept for up to 6 months. The stalk is preferred, but the green leaves are an excellent condiment. Cut the roots and trim the green leaves. Discard the outermost, toughest leaves from the stalk as if you were peeling an onion. Make small cuts lengthwise and wash it under cold running water to remove dirt. The stalk is eaten raw in salads. Cooked or sautéed, it can be used as an ingredient in just about any savory dish. The flavor imparted by leek is unique and enhances the flavor of food, being more pronounced when it is sautéed, compared to cooking. Potato leek soup is a traditional dish in French cuisine. As an accompaniment, cut the leek into two or four pieces lengthwise, sauté in garlic butter and salt. When it is soft, add fresh cream and keep it on the fire until the cream forms a layer over the leek. Leek gratin ingredients. Six leeks, washed and cut into five centimeters pieces, three tablespoons of margarine or butter, one cup, tea, of milk, two tablespoons of wheat flour, one cup, tea, of cheese, three teaspoons mustard sauce, salt to taste, breadcrumbs for sprinkling directions one. Choose tender and firm leeks. Wash them and cut them into 5 cm pieces. 2. Distribute the leeks in a greased shape and set aside. 3. In a pan, melt the margarine or butter, add the wheat flour and stir until golden. Lower the heat, add the mustard, salt and milk and stir until thickened. 4. Add the cheese, stir until melted and sprinkle over the garlic. 5. Sprinkle the breadcrumbs over the sauce and bake at medium temperature for 15 minutes or until golden. Preparation and cooking time, 40 minutes yield, 6 servings suggestion serve with roast beef. Leek meat cake ingredients, 3 cups, tea, of ground beef, 1 cup, tea, of leeks, cut into pieces, 3 quarters cup, tea, of breadcrumbs, 10 chopped olives, salt and pepperoni to taste, 1 half cup, tea, of chopped parsley how to make it 1. Mix all the ingredients well, kneading with your hand, until the mixture is homogeneous. 2. Place the dough in a small loaf pan, greased with oil, level the dough and bake in a preheated oven at medium temperature, 180 OC, for about 45 minutes or until the dough is golden. Preparation time, 60 minutes yield, 8 servings suggestion can be served as a main course in lunch and dinner, accompanied by white rice and salad, or alone at snack time. Now you have a lot of knowledge about this vegetable, thank you for staying until the end of the video and I ask you to subscribe to our channel and activate the bell and you will be notified when I post more videos that will help your health. Watch the other videos on the channel and until the next video.